Howdy cowdies. Welcome to a little weekly walk about the collector. Heaps of cool stuff this week. I think James and Annabelle are too busy watching bloody Anaconda or something. I don't know. But there's some cool stuff. A nice little micro mosaic and some gold jewellery. Nice little RJ Fausing Danish sterling silver ring there. Another nice little one over the back in the Jensen box. Some gold rings. Lovely bit of Lalique. I think it is pre-war. It's signed a Lalique as opposed to just Lalique, which dates it for us, the mark. Got some lovely bracelets and some really nice big sterling silver teapots, coffee pots there as well. Beautifully hallmarked. Lots of nice jewellery, markersite and glitzy diamante stuff. Some silver. Cool little spider brooch in amongst the group lot there. They're lovely as well, the gents' buttons, all made out of agate, really quite nice. There's lots of nice little bits and bobs in the jewellery cabinet. Some of the cool stuff we got. There you go. Little tortoise. Pretty cool. Little Air Zone radio is really nice, all original with a little white front and the little buttons there with little sort of stars on the buttons. He's a ripper. Little pot cabinet's quite nice, bit unusual with a little sort of little shield shaped section over the back. He's pretty cool, the big radio console cab at the top lifts off. Uh, there's doors in the back, but there's no workings in it. It's kind of cool, that little glazed front section there. They're going to look great with a little TV in there. Nice big pair of heavy, good quality Poke audio speakers. They're made in the States. A little record cabinet. Vanessa's not for sale this week. A little record cabinet's cool, and another little one there. Little white painted sideboard's nice. We've got heaps of cool clothes and stuff. Pretty cool this old ski jacket actually. Real sort of waist cut there with the longer sleeves hanging down. Some cool hats. Some masks and stuff. More hats. Good little Ned uh, turntable there with a nice big pair of JBL speakers. Some good records. Cool old motorbike helmets and stuff up the top. Some more really bad sort of 60s hats. These are interesting, the 16mm silent films. I think you've got Wizard of Oz, uh, 20,000 Legs Under the Sea, 1916 and 1924 or something like that. Silent films, pretty interesting. A nice little guitar amp, little Marshall valve state there. Nice big lot of stereo equipment, audio equipment. <laughs> the Life of Brian movie poster. Nice little retro tub chair. More boxes of clothes and stuff like that. Some big 70s prints. Pretty cool. Group of Marilyn Monroe prints there on the wall. More big boxes of vintage clothing and materials and stuff. There's a flying duck. Some cool Elvis ephemera. Other rock and roll stuff. More boxes of hats. Pretty cool little national record player there with a the sort of briefcase with the speakers as the lid. Nice little retro stool on top of a nice little retro desk. They're separate lots, but they'll sell quite well. Cool little bits. Some nice outdoor furniture down the bottom there, including the big fold-out picnic table. Some more cool clothing, sunglasses, boxes of records, nice old rocker. Chevelle mirror is really quite nice. More military hats and braiding and stuff in the box. He's pretty cool. Little rocking aeroplane. He's fantastic. I kind of like this as well. We had one of these a while ago. This is another one. It's in a little bit poorer condition, but really cool though. The big sort of deck chair there with a sort of extension on the end to turn into a banana lounge and with a little sunshade on top. Really cool thing. Yeah, what else have we got this week, guys? Records and cool old sort of comics. Annuals. Bit of soul and funk sort of stuff in that lot. Big lot of costume jewellery there. Cool platform shoes and other boots and stuff. Bags, big lots of costume. Interesting little bits there. The carriage lamp and the little Kinsel timing light. Some more cool Marilyn Monroe prints. The big oil painting there of the bathers. Pretty cool. A little framed Elvis presentation with a little reproduction record. Great movie. Good old Alfie with Michael Caine. Another great movie. Through the Looking Glass. The first motion picture that explores supernatural sex. Wow. Huh? Lucky ghosts. Some cool Marilyn Monroe posters again. We've got heaps of cool shirts and ladies and gents clothing this week. It's not all ladies stuff. Some cool gents stuff in amongst. Big leather jackets. Some bad cowboy shirts. Look at that red and sort of floral thing there. Some 
cool suits, Astrakhan, another big rack of clothes over there as well, and some nice stuff here, there's some cool stuff on this rack, this is pretty amazing, this sort of cowboy shirt there, with the brown suit to go with it, the Victorian bustle dress is pretty cool, I reckon this is one of the best fits, original sort of biker, vogan jacket, punk, Subhumans written down the bottom there. I think it's got the exploited on the back. Pretty cool with all the sort of sewn on leopard print. All the studs are original. Really cool thing. Speaking of really cool. Yeah, look at those bathers, huh? Had you be cruising down the beach in Morty Alec and those puppies, huh? <laughs> really cool smoker's jacket as well, actually. A smoking jacket. Some nice stuff. Oh, 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 oh cowboy. Now, what else have we got, guys? Some more records, Thunderball, soundtrack's pretty cool. Little Bugs Bunny clocks are repo, it's got the battery cover. Some Barbie furniture, some vintage lingerie and corsets and stuff. Cool pair of old RM Williams boots there. More good records and hats and big biker boots. The Johnny Reb, Thomas Cook ones. Good record. I think that's signed by Kate Bush, that one over the back. Cool big pair of cowboy boots, giddy up. Good old Scarface. Breakfast at Tiffany's, they're nice, just decorative prints all stretched over a canvas. Mackenzie Theory LP is pretty cool, a lot of sort of early Melbourne experimental sort of stuff. Some nice ladies' hats, red and green phone, stop and go. Old Playboys, lingerie, originals, all sort of with a t um, tags, labels and stuff. A couple of nice Stones albums and some Cure records. These are pretty cool. A little lot of lobby cards from Phantasm, which was a Playboy movie that was actually filmed in Australia. I think all the stars came out and caught it, including good old Johnny Holmes. <laughs> cool little lot. Some more movie posters down the bottom there. Jerry Lewis, Family Jewels. More cool lobby cards. Really like the little green parasol. Some great hats. A little taxidermy cane toad and some more cool hats. A bit of Led Zepp. Some Japanese porcelain dinner plates are pretty cool with the oriental peacock design. Nice big bit of blushware there, Austrian. These are pretty cool, the Jeremy Scott designed Adidas runners. And this is fantastic, the Grundy Cube speaker there, it weighs a ton. Very cool bit of 19 sort of 70s, some Laurel and Hardy lobby cards. James Bond movie poster. The old advertising there for Pantene. A little campaign kit there for a film, Feminina. Here we go again, little lobby card featuring good old Charlie McCarthy. Some nice clocks, three stooges, eight millimeter film. This is pretty cool, this. What is this? The At the Mountain of Madness by Blackfeather. Big LP record there, which has got Bon Scott playing tambourines and recorders. Oh, and he has a crack at the triangle as well. <laughs> Interesting thing. There you go, the taxidermy cobra fighting the little mongoose or whatever it actually is. Yeah, there's heaps of cool stuff in the sale this week, guys. Heaps of clothing and accessories and the rest, plus some other stuff for everyone else. I really like that little mirror with the frosted crinoline lady. She's really cute. Anyway, hopefully you saw something you liked. If you didn't, you know the score. Bad luck.